All right, guys, we're getting ready to head out again on the boat. And we have some friends today, and we're going to have a great time out at the sandbar. So stay tuned for the show. Peace. You're watching Key's Boating Channel. Like and subscribe. We're heading out for a beautiful sandbar day with our good friend David, his wife Yenia, and his daughter Brittany. The weather forecast for today is 9 miles per hour from the east and 3 miles per hour in the afternoon from the east as well. The rain forecast around 17%. And all in all, it sounds like an awesome day. When we arrived to the open waters of the Atlantic side of the Florida Keys, we experienced winds much higher than predicted. I believe they probably were close to 18 through 20 miles an hour, and um, wow, it was blowing. Because of these high winds, it was really difficult to anchor the boat uh, since it's pushing sideways. I couldn't uh, put the boat the way we liked it looking at the sandbar so the winds were pushing so hard I, I mean it, it must have been at least 18 to 20 because you can see my clothes there how it's flapping from that wind and uh, we tried to put the boat uh, uh, the way the best we can but uh, this is uh, how it went right here after about an hour and a half to two hours those winds all of a sudden disappeared and all we had is about three miles an hour, which was the forecast originally, that we had three for the afternoon and nine in the morning. Well, the morning was way more than nine. And the afternoon, it was accurate, about three miles an hour. And it was beautiful. All right, guys, uh, this week, compared to last week, we had winds last week of 14 that felt like 15 or 16. Well, this week, we have winds of nine in the forecast that feels like 20 so you can never go by the forecast you have to make your own determination when you come out because you, they never get it right so today they said nine and then the afternoon three and it feels like 20 so but anyway no matter what we're still gonna have a good time and we're ready to start the party so stay tuned for the show peace
DR. DR, Dominican Republic, right here in the house. Ooh. And you? I'm from Homestead. Homestead, Homestead. Hey, I'm a Homestead guy too. I lived in Homestead for many, many years. Homestead. El Salvador in the camera. Eh? El Salvador. Exactly. He's El Salvador in. in the house, people. Yes. Having a good time here. And they're watching who now? You're, You're watching Key's Boating Channel. Like and subscribe. All right, everybody here at Tavernier Key is always so friendly, all friendly, that everybody's always ready to plug the channel and help out. Thank you guys for helping out, and we love you guys for being part of the Keys Boating Channel. Keys, now they're telling me there is a manta ray, manta ray right here in front of us, so let's see what we have here. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? The manta. It's gone. Yeah, today we had experience uh, some nurse sharks, but nurse sharks don't do anything. So they'll come to you, they see you, they go a different direction. So don't be afraid of those. Uh, if you see a great white. All right, if you see a great white, not around here in the Florida Keys. Anyway, guys, have a good time. Enjoy your day. Peace. guys we're here and a super relaxing day here at Tavernier Key as you notice there's not that many people here this weekend this is the weekend after Labor Day weekend and it's really only like one two three and I think on this side we have a couple of more here and that and, and us and that's it there's nobody else here it is super peaceful the wind started way up there it said nine in the forecast and it happens to be I think closer to 20 when we when we arrived here uh, and now it's going down so the winds are probably going down like they forecast the property nine and that's what it looks like about nine but um, yeah it, 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 it was really crazy windy uh, this morning uh, it's supposed to be the forecast said three miles an hour in the afternoon I think it's more like about the eight or nine that they were saying earlier in the morning. So let's see how it pans out. But it's peaceful. And there's another some other boats coming in. And uh, little by little, it'll probably get a little full. But I think today's going to be a nice, peaceful, calm day here 
I just have an ear to keep. Today, the island here is empty. There's only just a handful of boats here. No matter what, it's still awesome. I mean, even if it's empty, Tavernier Key is the no number one place to be. And you can not even know until you get here to Tavernier Key and enjoy this place. Okay, even if you have four or five boats or 30 or 40 boats, it is always a great place to come and visit. And, and have a good time so i hope you enjoy this video thank you so much for watching peace all right people it's that time of the day again where we have to go back again and i know you i always say the same thing but i really don't like leaving but we have to leave and we'll be back next week again at the same time so stay tuned for the next adventure here in the florida keys hope you like this video and peace enter Tavernier Creek channel on the ocean side just make sure that when you see those two markers the red and green you should stay in between because it's shallow on both sides so remember when you see red and green stay in between done washed down and ready for the next sandbar adventure hope you like this video and we'll see you on the next time thank you so much for watching and peace thank you gracias danca abrigado merci grazie arigato 
to subscribe now, all you have to do is click on that big red subscribe button below, it's free, and you'll be part of the Keys Boating Channel family, thanks for your support.